car drive along, and I'll narrate this. We're not quite to the beginning of the project. But as you can see, it's a narrow road. Um, most of Bowman Road's the same way. 24 foot wide lanes. Uh, this is approximately where the beginning of the bridge is going to start taking off. And uh, as you can see, we kind of have this blind curve going into the bridge itself. As we come across here, we have the post as a one lane bridge. This sign right here is a um, load limiting sign. It will handle standard loads, but it won't handle oversized or overweight loads. So it's another deficiency of the bridge itself. And then when the people come up to this bridge, most people slow down and stop right about here and kind of watch to see if there's any vehicles coming down. Um, it's certainly only one vehicle can travel at any time. Um, like I said, it's about 16 feet wide. And then coming out of this, we're at a sharp 90 degree hairpin curve. This is rated at 15 miles per hour. And as you're coming up here, there's an additional sight impaired curve going off to the right. This is about the area where the, the bridge will, and the uh, touchdown from the bridge will coincide with the existing roadway. The shoulders will be uh, a little wider and then they'll taper back. There'll be a new driveway constructed here. And essentially this is the end of the project right about there. I have some